Oh, do you think I do that often our, that our dose Vijay Varma was named after VJ Varma in Divine? Oh, that's a good question. I mean, I'm no VJ. There's is a lot. It's very a, common it, name. It could be just a common name. It just happened uh, to be that. I way. don't know. If Varma is also a common name. I think it is. But his name is exactly what it was in the film, <laughs> and so I didn't know. Maybe it could I'll, be. Maybe I'll ask our. Our dose. I bet that's happened a lot. That mm -hmm. people have been named after an iconic character mm -hmm. from some film. Yeah, probably. Juice! Hey, welcome back to our stupid directions. Let's get a clue. To blave. To blave! Which means to bluff! Mm -hmm. Today, we got a informational video. Uh, top five mysterious places in Tamil Nadu, specifically. Oh, Tamil specifically Nadu. there. Tamil All Nadu. right. It's a very interesting video about the top five mysterious places in Tamil Nadu, and that is a, uh, where there's where no there's... scientific reasoning behind these centuries-old places. You mean like their existence? I mean, uh, there's probably some scientific. You just probably don't know them. <laughs> there's usually a scientific reason uh, behind most things. I disagree. Oh, no. Like, there's not behind most things? Nope. Oh, Okay. All science is a fallacy based on this time-space continuum and wouldn't work outside of it. I'm just being a fool right now. Neither Katie! Name Jack Firstly, and I! Firstly, that has a rich history and folklore, Tamil Nadu is home to a number of mysterious places and phenomena. Welcome to Sindhi Nice Chico. rock! Today, we are listing out the top five mysteries in Tamil Nadu that continue to baffle one and all. Was big number five. At number five, we have the foreigner statues at Tanjavur Temple. Ancient architecture and carvings tend to reveal a lot about our history. Like many southern temples, the Brihadishwara Temple at Tanjavur, Tamil Nadu has several gods and saints carved on it. Built almost 1000 years ago, in 1010 AD, the temple has the figure of a European looking person carved on it. This figure is also believed to resemble the then king of France, Robert II. Similarly, the same temple also has the figure of a Chinese man carved on it. Historians tell us that the world was not connected until 1500. In fact, the first European to set foot on Indian soil was Vasco da Gama in 1498, almost 500 years after the construction of this temple. Yeah, you don't know that for sure though. Does that mean that the then Indian king Rajaraja Choran had already established international relations with other countries? Well, if the Wi-Fi signal was strong enough. what was enough. their means of communication? <laughs> these are intense, these, yes, it is. these numbers. At four, we have Krishna's butter ball. At Mahabalipuram stands a huge boulder measuring 20 feet here in height called butterball turkeys. with a diameter of 5 meters. Known as Krishna's butterball, I want to push this it. rock weighs over 250 tons and yet stands precariously balanced I love that on stuff. a mere Me area I love of stuff 4 like square feet on a Giant very rock on a tiny little... yeah. What is even more amazing is that it has been so for over 1200 years. Well, Considering the danger it posed to the been around a long time. The governor of Madras, Arthur Lolly, employed seven elephants to push the rock in 1908. But much to the amazement of everyone, the rock did not budge and the task was abandoned. It's a tough rock. No one has been able to explain how such a heavy boulder remains perfectly balanced at an incline. Erosion. Thor! Thor can move it. I agree. At third position, we have the Sweating Idol. About 5 kilometers from Nagapatinam in Tamil Nadu is a place called Sikkal, which is famous for the Singar Abelavar Subramanya Temple. Every year in mid-October November, the temple celebrates the victory of Lord Subramanya over the demon Surapadman. On the fifth day of this six-day festival, as per legend, the Lord receives his veil or his weapon from his mother to vanquish the demon. During this part of the festival, the idol of Lord Subramanya is set to sweat profusely, signifying the anger of the Lord who eagerly waits to kill the demon. This water is sprinkled on the devotees to bless them. 
the sweating subsides when the idol returns to its shrine on the sixth day of the festival. That's crazy. I would like to see that. A sweating Coming idol. second is Nachiyar Kalgarudar. The Nachiyar temple in Kumbakonam is known for a very mysterious phenomenon. It is home to the famous statue of Kalgarudan or the stone statue of Lord Vishnu's Eagle Mount. Each year during the Tamil months of Margari and Panguni, the statue is taken out of the main sanctum for a procession. It is said that as the statue moves out of the temple, its weight increases exponentially. Thus, the number of people required to carry the idol increases from 4 to 8, 16, 32, 64 and so on. Wow! Similarly, when the idol is brought back into the shrine, the weight decreases and the number of people required to carry the float comes down from 64 to 4. This inexplicable change right. in the weight of the idol continues to baffle scientists and devotees alike. Wow! At first place is the Ram Setu Bridge. The mystery of the floating Ram Setu bridge has always teased us. This bridge, built of floating stones, can still be seen between India and Sri Lanka. According to Ramayana, 1.7 million years ago, the bridge was built by architects Nala and Neil, along with an army of 10 million Vanaras or monkeys, to help Lord Ram cross the ocean to rescue his wife Sita from the clutches of the demon Ravan. The powerful Vanaras threw huge boulders of limestone into the shallow sea with the name of Lord Ram written on it. This made the rocks float and a 30 km long and 3 km wide bridge was constructed in mere 5 days between Dhanushkodi in India and Sri Lanka's Mannar Island. Since this story is very old and unproven, many historians, scientists and archaeologists deny this being Lord Ram's miracle. At the same time, they fail to explain the concept of floating stones found in Rameshwaram. There's there have been speculations rocks? of the rocks being either pumice or corals, but both the theories have scientifically been disproven. Was this bridge actually built by the powers of Lord Ram, or is this a man-made structure with a science behind it? What do you think? Send us your comments. That's the and coolest one. I would actually, be very cool. I would actually like to go there and look at it. Yeah. <laughs> I'm such a skeptic. I don't believe anything anybody ever tells me. <laughs> uh, but, like, that's so interesting because obviously, my first thought would be like, um, is it lava rock? Lava rock's lighter right. than, than other yeah, that than doesn't other, than other rock. It doesn't surprise me that there would be a rock that has weight to it but is still buoyant. But and obviously, like you saw from the satellite, there's like a, an entire a long row. And it wouldn't surprise me if it was man made. Man-made, or if there was, if it's on, I don't know if it's on a fault line or something, because obviously in in, in, um, in Ireland and, and Scotland, mm -hmm. there's this thing called the Giant's Causeway. Okay. And Never you've probably it. seen pictures of it, but it's the, the rocks that look like they're stepping stones. Okay. They literally look like stepping stones. Uh, the Giant's Huh. It's a natural thing huh. that happened, but the story is that there were there's uh, on either side, uh, on Scotland and then on Ireland, yeah. it was two giants that were angry at each other and they uh. threw stones and it made this formation. Interesting. But that's it's uh, from uh, lava uh, is kind of what made that. But it's a extreme. I went there when I went to Ireland. It's an extremely cool place. It looks uh, cool. Because it looks otherworldly. Mm -hmm. um, but like I, that, that would be my first thought of it. But I don't know if it's on a fault line or anything. The one, that, the one that's intriguing to me is, do they definitively know that carrying the idol out, that more weight is actually being pressed down? Yeah, I don't because know. Because for it to go from 4 to 64 and then 64 and then back, that's that's yeah. I would like odd. to I would like to experience it because once again I'm a skeptic and so I'm like I feel like you guys just want to keep this story up and so you're adding more people. <laughs> <laughs> that yeah, be... we're not gonna tell anybody, but we're just we're getting tired, so we need more people to carry it because the longer you carry it, the heavier it feels. So we need to add more people to it. But I don't think that's anywhere remotely close. But to the obviously, case. if that if that's the case and it like gets that's super cool and super weird and I love that. Yeah. Um, well, there are phenomena like yeah, that yeah, in certain absolutely. places. Like it's. They call it the Bermuda Triangle for a reason. It's true that airplane instruments 
have historically in the past started malfunction there because there's something going on in the Bermuda Triangle. Yeah. Um, so yeah, there's a bunch of cool stuff that I would like to be able to see and experience these weird phenomena. Yeah, because there's too. a lot uh, around the world. It's a, it's a cool place. Um, but <laughs> once again, I'm a skeptic. Uh, so I tend to not believe people. Like, Rick, tell me something. The pyramids. I don't believe you. Oh. See? I told you I'm a skeptic. <laughs> <laughs> Have you ever seen the pyramids no. in person? Prove they exist. Just because I've seen a picture of the pyramids doesn't mean it exists. I bet they're tiny. I bet, th I bet they're little, and I bet they were made by a couple of guys in Pittsburgh. <laughs> yeah, totally. <laughs> Anyways, that was cool. Let us know other uh, videos of... Anything. We did one haunting, mysterious. Yeah. We like Especially these. the mysterious stuff. We like this kind of stuff. Yeah. So, Inexplained. Uh, or if it's informational, please let us know what other videos we can react to down below. Just